do you know how to create a dll file and what is the benefit of creating dll file if you not then you need to listen to this video carefully because i am going to show you how you can convert your vv file or a cs file into a dll and execute that dll inside nx so let's start i do have one example this is a .cs file it means it is a c sharp code and you can see this i have opened in a journal editor now this is a cs file the best way to run this cs file is i open a journal editor and uh, in journal editor i pick up the file and then i execute it this is one way of executing the file but there is another better way of executing file that is creation of dll so let me show you how you can create a dll file what i have done i have copied this code into a journal sorry into a visual studio but before you copy this code into a journal uh, into a visual studio what you need to do first definitely you need to open your visual studio go to file new project and in this project if you are converting a cs file if you want to convert a cs file into dll then choose a c sharp uh, for a language uh, choose a windows here and then in all project types you need to find out a dll option a class library dll option i mean so if you search for the class library you might get lot of options this is a c sharp class library which targets the dotnet and dotnet standard but we don't need this one we will need this this is class library dotnet framework and uh, this creates a c sharp class library dll so as we wanted to create a dll you need to pick up this option for creating new project and when you hit next you will see some options to fill up its location its project name and uh, you always choose this uh, solution as create new solution and once you create it it will create that solution with the entire folder structure so for now i will click cancel because i do have already created the project like this and copied the entire code here now dll creation is very simple once you have this project created and your code copied here you just go and save all it means you are going to save the entire stuff but before that you definitely need to have uh, do this which is adding the references you need to go to solution explorer right click to the references folder click on add references and select all the five dlls which are required for you to have into your nx project so you pick up all these five uh, dlls you can see them very well on the screen if you wanted to note them down you pause this video and note the folder location of these uh, dlls as well and add into your solution and once you have added that the only one step that you need to do is go to build in the menu and do build solution even if uh, you do rebuild that's perfectly fine but you have to do this and once you do this watch out for the output window in the output window you will definitely see uh, uh, the progress of uh, rebuilding this solution and you will also see the the message that rebuilt all one succeeded zero failed it means my rebuild is successful and there is no failure at all and i can even get the folder location of this dll now once i have this dll i can simply go and copy this i 
8 into nx i will use control u for execution of a dll and then here i will paste that a dll file location and click ok what this is going to do this will execute that dll that co that uh, code that i copied from a cs file eventually and it will run inside this uh, this uh, nx environment so this is how you create and execute your dll here i am introducing a course called c sharp essentials for nx open customization and programming enroll now and unlock the power of customization in nx don't miss out